Good morning, everyone. This is Ty Creek Rock back for another exciting day here on the Ark Survival Evolved Crystal Isles map. This is day number three of our little adventure, and we had another quite horrible night. As you've seen at the end of the last episode, I died to a Ravager and lost my most chomps. Well, after all that happened, I respawned at that bed over there at my little place and immediately got killed by the Ravager again, so I couldn't respawn at the bed the second time. So the second time I responded a random location, and I don't know where it was at, but I started picking bushes and finally made me up a set of cloth armor and immediately died to a baryonyx at that other location. So then I respawned over here back at my bed at my place again, messed around there for a while trying to get re-equipped and everything, and eventually that ravager came back and killed me yet again. But then I respawned at that bed and I immediately ran over this way away from where the Ravenger was at. So I was hoping he wouldn't be hanging around my base forever. So during the night I've been trying to get re-equipped again. Because I'm going to have to go over and get my stuff at my base. And kill that Ravenger or something. I don't know what I'm going to do. This is just a really hostile start for a game. I think I've already died six times and it's just now day three starting. So this is a really hostile area to start at. And I can't really craft nothing here. I'm going to put my weight up to 200, I think. And I'm going to try to go back and get my stuff. That Ravager is just going to kill me again, though. If I can't... I'm thinking maybe I can just lure him off. This is an old chance I'm going to have, I think. Just run up there and take off running and let him kill me again. Just try to get him away from my base, and then I can get my stuff when I respawn. Problem is, you can't hardly see the guy. Right there he is, I think. He's uh, hanging around there. He'll probably come running here any second and kill me. Wish I could pick this bush and get it out of my face. Yep, here he comes. Let's get as far away as we possibly can, so when, he, when I respawn, he won't be right next to my base. Maybe I can outrun him. I've never got this far away from one before. I can hear him, though. He's right on me. And my stamina's fixing to run out. Yep, he's caught me. Punch him in the face. Ah. That Ravager has killed me three times now. That's pretty bad. But at least now he won't be right next to my base and I can respawn at my bed and hopefully collect my stuff back. This has been the roughest start I've had in Ark in a long time. I think that's made seven deaths I've had. Hopefully the Ravager don't immediately run back over here now. He should be way over yonder. I should have some stuff in a bag here somewhere. If I can find it. Where did you kill me at last time? So I really do need that stuff. I had a lot of good stuff in it. Had shoes and a full set of armor and some bows and arrows. And so I really need that stuff back. If I can find it. You can't pick up these twigs and stuff down here, which is a shame. I think I got in the water a little way, so maybe it's over here in the water. Well, if I can't find my stuff, I'm going to be a hurting. Oh, there it is, right under a bush. Yep, I needed that stuff. Let's dump out these extra implants and stuff and get my everything re-equipped. I need to make us a campfire and stuff. Don't need those implants. We have died a bunch of times. And we need to craft us up another need a campfire and we need another storage box. Which means we need more thatch. The thatch is going to require me getting into these mangrove trees I think. Because I don't get thatch off these ones up on land. This is going to risk me getting a baryonyx attack. Come on, 
harvest up so we can get out of this mess. We're overweight again. I reckon if you're in the water, Baryonyxes will come after you. And if you get too close to them, they'll also come out after you. I found that out during the night. I died to one. Time to set up a campfire, cook us up some meat. Put up another box, because we just ain't got enough storage. And we need two more foundations here. And we need a door. And we need a bunch more arrows, I guess. This base is probably going to be pretty much temporary, but I'm going to make it anyway. At least till I can find my way out of here. Okay, we might be able to protect ourselves from some stuff if we can get this thing boxed in. And get us a fire going so we can cook us up some meat here. couple of stacks of meat. Thanks to our most chomps. Our most chomps is a pretty good guy. But we've lost him again though. Lost two most chomps already. Now we've got a whole extra set of gear here. We might as well put all that up. Did I make two campfires by accident? Apparently I did. You know what, I ain't got no clothes on, do I? That's why I've got all that extra armor. Don't even have none on. Well, let's put the extra stuff up now. So if we die again, at least we'll have a change of clothes and a torch. This one's got a bunch of torches and cotton and berries. I guess I'm going to stick my hide in there because I don't have much of it anyway. And what am I going to put in here? Let's put the rare flowers in there. And I have rare mushrooms. I think I had a few of them just in case I see a most chops. Let's see, I guess everything else we just need to carry. We need to go harvest us up some more stuff. Get us a little bit of meat here. And let's go harvest some wood and trees and stuff and see if we can get anywhere in this valley. Right up here is where the Ravengers came from. Uh, you can pick these little red bushes. I need to quit picking bushes. I need to start harvesting wood and thatch. And be careful what I run into. There's a Parasitherium. I think I, my first spawn spot was up on that hillside up there. And I don't see no way of ever getting back up there, though. That is not good. Do not harvest these old black trees where they pick, because you'll just get all charcoal. I'm going to have to get out in the water to get thatch, I think. That seems the mangrove trees are the only thing I can get it from. Dump this charcoal. It's just heavy. I don't need it. 
and it's raining. And I'm gonna have to sneak out in there and try to harvest some of these trees up. This is definitely swamp, and I'm gonna die out here. I really dislike swamps. Most chumps killed a level 235 spider down here yesterday. So they some super high level creatures down in this area. Which is not a good thing. The only thing is I can't run because I'm overweight. Maybe it's just that parasitherium off in the distance making the noise. go. Box my little place in here, maybe. Craft up a bunch more walls if we can. Oh, that is way too many. We don't need 20 of those. Shocked I can make that many. Make about six, I think. Yep, let's stop that. Let's see, do we want to put a door up? Let's put a door up. How many spears do I have? Just five. Let's craft us up a few more arrows. Let's see if we got enough to box this place off yet. Probably not. Sure use us another most chomps. They're a lot better than I originally would have thought they would have been. That might keep the baryonyx off of us. I'm gonna raise it up a little bit here. One more of these and then I'm gonna up about three of these. Then I'm gonna have to make some slope ceilings, I think. a little hut throwed up down here even though I'm probably not going to stay down here. Let's learn how to do slopes really quick here. Let's see, I want to put some some into stamina, I guess. Let's put one into stamina here. And unlock these thatch ceilings or slope ceilings. And we're at level Okay, we've only got 21 points left. We're at level 17. We could do some water or a storage box. Let's do the large storage box. And what else? What else do we want to unlock? Let's do stimulant. That leaves us with very little left. I guess water skin. Let's do the water skin. Let's see if we can craft us up some slopes and stuff and work on our roof real quick here. Okay, we need two of each of these. And we ain't got enough of those, though. A 
My luck, something will come along big enough to tear this place down pretty soon. Pretty good, I guess. Have us a small hut. We gotta do some exploring. This is gonna be our swamp hut. Swamp hut. What do we need to craft more of these things? Okay, we want a large storage box, which is gonna require a bunch of wood, I think. Wood and thatch. That's so what we need is wood and thatch. We know that Ravager's over up where that green beam is, so we can't go that way. I'm worried there's going to be a Spinosaur up here and just destroy my place pretty soon. So, how many of these trees is it going to take to make a... Let's go ahead and craft up what I can craft up here. Okay, crafting. Slope ceilings. How many can we get out of that? Oh, that is too many. Yeah, let's clear that. What do we need to make a large storage box? Probably more wood. Yeah, a little more wood. Let's place this stuff so we won't be carrying so much stuff around. I'd like to have windows in this, but I don't have the window frames unlocked yet. And like I said, I probably won't be here very long. If I can find my way out of this mess, I probably will. Okay, let's go get some more wood. Don't like these bushes being in my way. Can't see over in this direction. I'm sure they'll grow back instantly though once I pick them. And you get rare flowers out of these dragon tail plants. And you get rare mushrooms out of the mangrove trees. Which I'm going to have to go harvest another one because that's the only way I can get thatch down here. But I seem to be overloading the berries now. looks weird right there that don't even look like one maybe that'll be enough we might be able to get back up on that hill right up there to give that a try after I get this put up Craft another ceiling. And I want a storage box. Did I not get enough for that? Still need a little bit more wood. Hmm. And I got my little hut closed in here. It's not a very good one or nothing by any means, but 
It's a start. It's not getting much wood that way, am I? I am encumbered. Need to get out of the water pretty quickly here. Get out of the water before a baryonyx or something comes up through here. I gotta level up. This is not a very exciting way to play Ark, I have to say. Let's see, where do I want to put this cabinet at? Probably right here. I made a piece of wooden flooring. Because I had a little extra wood left. Should give me a little more storage. Put some berries and stuff in there, I guess. Fiber. These rare mushrooms. I know I can't really store them good, but okay. Well, I've tried to venture out a little bit. I think I'm gonna leave that extra meat in there because I am likely to die again. I do need to repair my pick and my hatchet and stuff. What have I got to repair them with? Need a piece of flint for that one. We'll get that on the way. I'm going to try to get back up that hillside over there and have a look around. I tried picking these rocks right here, but I didn't get no flint out of them. So I don't know what's up with that. Yep, I'm definitely going to die over here pretty soon, I would say. And there is actually rocks you can pick up in just in the open. You just have to spot ones that ain't in the ground. Okay, I have a level up, don't I? I didn't even notice that. What do we want to put this one in? A little more stamina. That puts us to level 18. What can we unlock at 18? Feeding troughs, preserving bin. Let's unlock a preserving bin. That took most of them. What is that? A moving up there. Kangaroo. Maybe I get some flint off of this rock here. And repair my hatchet with that. This up here looks like a much safer spot. Yep, nope, there's a baryonyx. Spoke too soon, didn't I? Not going that way, we're going up the hill. Kind of want to see if I can find where my original spawn location was, and I think it must be up there somewhere. Have a look at the map really quick. I still haven't really went anywhere. I could tame a Jerboa, couldn't I? Astro. I don't really want to spend a lot of time taming a lystra. I would like to have another moss chomp, so. 
Rella tops. I did see an Alpha Raptor somewhere when I first spawned in. Which I'm afraid it might be up here somewhere also. I'll probably run right up on him here in a minute. Well, I can walk up this. I really didn't think I'd be able to do that. I bet I can't walk on up. Yep, I'm going to die right here. Die of fall damage. head around over that way where the Morella Tops is and see if that's where I seen that Alpha Raptor. Got to know what's around me. Morella Tops, did you see an Alpha Raptor over this way? Fifteen hundred hours. Let's check these trees out, see if they give thatch or if just they give charcoal. Just basically charcoal trees. I'm not liking that. If I was needing gunpowder, it would be great, but I don't really... I am completely lost. If I could ever find the place where I originally spawned again. Doesn't matter though because my most chomps died. I got the message on my screen. I got the message that he died. So I've lost two most chomps already and died about six or seven times. This is probably the roughest start I have. There's most chops. That's what I'm looking for. You probably want rare mushrooms, won't you? What do you want? I can't make that out. Aww. Rare flowers. I don't think I have any rare flowers with me. Sure don't. I'm going to look right in this little hole here and see what's in here. I would like to tame me another moss chops, though. Because those are pretty good. There is water here. Might be a good base location. A lot better than down there by the swamp where I'm at. Guess I can go grab a few rare mushrooms and come back up here and maybe tame up this moss chops. Where'd you go? I heard him, I just can't see him. He's obviously in those bushes. There he is. What level are you? Level 20, probably one rare flower, probably tame him. See if we can go get one. Kangaroo, are you running from or something? Probably, my luck. I have a hard time finding this place again, I think. Got these big spooky trees off in the distance. This is a nice looking little area right up here. But I'm down here in the swamp and this is enough of a fall to kill me. And right there is my house. Yep, I can't take this fall. Is there a way for me to get down without going all the way around? I guess there is not. Yeah, 
this is terrible. I shouldn't have built down there, but I know that I was probably going to die pretty soon, and I wanted to have a bed up as soon as possible. It's not a great spot for sure. And it's just a big drop off all around here, ain't it? There's two or baryonyx and a kangaroo, and the baryonyx is chasing the kangaroo. That's not good. He's going to run him right over toward my base, ain't you? I can get rare flowers without going all the way to my base, though, if I just get down to the edge of the water and pick some. And there's one of those vents coming up by the ground. shocked I haven't seen any crocodiles or caprasuchuses yet. Caprasuchuses. Right here is the rare flyers. Let's get some of these and get back up there and see if we can well, we didn't get a single one out of that. Tame that moss chops. It'd be nice to have our third moss chops in three days. If I can get a rare flyer. Why am I not getting any? There's one. Let's see if we can get up there before it gets dark on us and tame that guy. Dump some of these off because we're running heavy. And it is getting kind of late, so we're probably going to get up here in the dark and not be able to find our way back down. Let's go do it anyway. Hope for the best. Hope one rare flower is enough to tame up a level 20. I think it probably will be. We almost had a 140 tamed if a raptor hadn't found us before we got it done. This is a definite way of dying right here, running through bushes and not being able to see through them. running your stamina out. Get up a weapon. Kangaroo. Let's hope that most chops is still around and still wants a rare flare. And nothing kills me before this happens. There you are. Come on, tame up for me in one bite. Rare mushroom, I thought you wanted a rare flare. I'm dead anyway. Yep, dang raptor, and it's only level 15. Well, that kind of stunk. At least I got a bed to respawn at. Respawn at bed on day three, and it's 1800 hours. Well, I've got a little base set up on day three. I had a couple of most chomps tamed, but I don't know more. But anyway, I'm just going to get re-equipped and spend the night here, I guess. So, probably going to end it off here. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And thanks again for watching. This is Tile Creek Rock on the new Crystal Isles map. Signing out.